Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video it's gonna be a haul. I'm gonna show you the latest things that I've bought for fall because I've bought quite a lot of stuff online and all of this stuff I bought from H&M. I don't like spending a lot of money on clothing because I like to change a lot. So yeah, I don't really buy super high quality items and I buy things that are on discount because you know I like to change and there's no point in spending a lot of money on an item of clothing if you're gonna change it like in a while so yeah I'm gonna show you what I've bought and if my kitten allows me because he goes crazy like he spends half of the day can you see or can you hear him at least like he keeps jumping he keeps jumping and going around and he's Look, and sometimes he like plays with his with his tail. He's weird, but I love him. And anyway, so yeah, we're I'm gonna show you the clothing. I was gonna do a try on thing, but I'm sorry, it's freezing cold today in Milan, and it's kind of rainy and cloudy, and that's another reason why I haven't uploaded that much because you know I I kind of wanted to pre-film, but it's been like three days of rain and clouds and I don't have professional lighting so yeah I need natural light to film and this is kind of the best lighting we can get today but yeah let's get straight into the video and I hope you enjoy it if you do please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and without any further ado let's begin so lately I've grown like into this kind of weird obsession with hoodies. I don't know why, I've always hated hoodies because I, I didn't like like the hood itself. But I've grown into them and they're baggy and they're comfy. I'm into, I'm in this kind of phase. Like last year I used to be really like polished and super, you know, elegant and tight clothing and really kind of sexy. Now I'm just like, I want cozy stuff. I want baggy clothes. I want comfy things. And yeah, so now I, that's the way I dress. That's why I said I don't like to spend a lot of money on, on clothing because I like to change really often and I change my style basing on how I feel. So this is the first item of clothing. I don't know if you can really see the color, but it's like a prune red, reddish thing, and I love it. There's a hood and thumbnail. <laughs> and anyway, okay, my hair now is a mess. I love it, it's really baggy. I always buy extra large stuff because I like things that are baggy. And yeah, so this is how long it is, and it has this pocket, and it's super warm, it's super comfy, and I really love it. Now let's get straight into the other clothing items that I've bought. You may say, you just said that it's freezing cold, and it's a full haul, so why did you buy shirts? Because I want to wear this with... What are they called? Stockings or something? Or even leggings underneath? These are high waist shorts and I've I've never had any high waist stuff and this fit me to perfection. I love them and yeah, this is a 42 or in American size it's a 12 and does that mean that I'm fat? Probably. I started exercising today, so I'm mad. I still do, don't see the results. And come on, come on, abs, come through. Anyway, second item of clothing. I've used it today to exercise because, as I said, it's cold, and even if it's even if I'm exercising, it's still cold. This is. Same color as this one, actually, a little lighter, and it's cheerleader, and it's a bit shorter, and it's not as thick. This is really thin, so it's not as warm as this one and the other ones that I've bought, but I really like it, you know, it's cool for, you know, just 
hanging out in your room or exercising. So yeah, I like this one. And everything was like, none of these items was above 16 euros, I think. Because I've bought the cheapest things that I could find. They were also the things that I liked the most, to be honest. I would never spend 60 euros for a hoodie, like that's a joke. So yeah, I mean, if you do, you do you. But personally, I find it like useless to spend that much money on an item of clothing personally, unless it's something really special, but for a hoodie, I don't really think it's worth money. But anyway, next item of clothing, it's my cat is doing pornographic stuff with my stuffed animal. Wait a second. He's hitting puberty, so yeah. So I've bought this, uh, oh my god, what's the name of this material? Ah, uh, gosh, I forgot, but these are amazing. I wore one of these in one of my latest videos, and come on, how beautiful is this? This is extra large, and it's so baggy, it's so comfy, and... You can see it's like sporty or something, it's some sporty material, and it says pretty, which is so me. <laughs> Just kidding. But I love it, and you can wear it with a top underneath, like I wear it with my normal tops, so it's not too cold. And this is great for when it's a little bit warmer and you're not going out, and it makes a great outfit, I think, for, you know, when you're feeling kind of... Not too glam, but it still makes a great outfit. So I bought a similar thing, but white. Here it is. It says superior. And as you can see, it's really baggy, like on me. Look, I have to go all the way here to show you the whole thing. It's really baggy, it's really cute, and yeah, I love it. It's white, it's exactly the same material, and it's not warm. It's not exactly the warmest thing ever but as I said with the top underneath or a nice bralette it looks amazing so yeah totally in love with this. As I said I've grown into this kind of obsession with hoodies and I've bought another one this is red this was 10 euros I think it was like discount and yeah, this is not exactly thick, but it's good for fall. And yeah, it says golden, even though it's red and it's written in black. But it's really good. It's a hoodie, you can see. And it's kind of, you know, the way it's cut. I love it. I really, really love it. And this is super comfy. This is great for doing nothing. This is this is why I bought all of this baggy stuff because I do nothing fancy. I'm not really the type of girl that goes out and really likes to, you know, dress up. I, I mean, I like doing that, but I don't do that often because I don't go out that much. I don't have that many friends. I don't like to party because that phase ended when I turned like 22. Like, that's it stop stop with parting no with when I was 21 actually like that phase completely ended and I get so bored in clubs like after 30 minutes I'm like can we leave so you know I don't do that kind of stuff and I like to be comfy and I think that comfy clothes if you're confident and with a bit of like simple makeup and maybe tight jeans they can look really really sexy and cute so you don't necessarily need to be, you know, dressed up, wearing look at things, and this is kind of the phase I'm going through, so I love this kind of hoodies. Another hoodie, and it says, female equals future. It's pink, I love it, it's so cute! And yeah, this is a large, and a bit thicker than the others, and as you see, it's a hoodie, 
it says female female equals future feeling so feminist like oh my god and then it says love on the back and I think it's really cute and it's really baggy and comfy again as everything else and I bought another one it's in the washing machine I'm sorry I forgot and anyway it's in the washing machine it's kind of like the cheerleader one but it's thicker it's blue and it says female female equals future so I bought two kind of feminist sweatshirts or hoodies or whatever you want to call them English is not my first language I say this in a lot of my videos so don't judge me try to speak two languages and yeah so shut up now let's get straight into the tops because that's another thing I love tops and I love low cuts as I said I don't dress up that much I don't think you need to wear low cut things but when it comes to tops t-shirts or whatever I like them to be low cut to have a V neck because yeah <coughs> I'm sorry I feel that turtlenecks or normal necks um, don't really complement my body shape so that's what I do and also I really like prune color <laughs> this this year I kind of like this purpley reddish kind of colors and I don't know why but fashion making fashion would step at the time trendsetter okay I'm I'm just gonna stop today I exercised I'm eating healthy so I'm feeling a bit hyper and you know in great shape that's why I'm acting crazy but this is beautiful this is not a v-neck but it's really loose neck and it's kind of low and it has a small pocket and it's gorgeous it's really gorgeous and you know it's comfy you can wear it underneath anything really underneath a sweater or a sweatshirt or you can wear it by itself it's if it's warm enough which oh my god can you see my kitten he's the cutest like seriously leave a thumbs up for my kitten who's kind of playing hide and seek by himself poor thing I'm gonna play with you in a second <laughs> then another top that I bought this is a t-shirt and this is kind of a rounded v-neck it's not exactly a bv but it's a rounded V and doesn't have a pocket and it's great. I love this color and I love the material. Like actually people, I hear people complaining a lot about H&M quality, but to be honest, I always buy things at H&M. I find myself going back to H&M every, every single time because I love the quality and I love the price yes sometimes they tend to shrink so i would always go like a size bigger and also that's my preference but some some kind of materials can shrink when you first wash them but color wise the color stays exactly the same for like ages they're comfy they do wear out as every other thing as every other piece of clothing and so I don't know why some people com complain that much about H&M because I really like it as a brand to be honest and considering the price of some things it's great this is basic this is the basic collection they have this kind of basic things that are really cheap and basic and I love it. I love basic stuff and this is, if you could feel it, this is the softest thing ever. I am obsessed. Then last thing, last t-shirt and I kind of bought this for the text. Um, it's not really my kind of thing, my cup of tea, but because as I said, it has like a round neck which I'm not a huge fan of but like revolutionary hashtag trendsetter 
this is so Instagram. This is so... I mean, I'm basic. I'm a basic white bitch. What do you expect? But I really like this one. And again, this is so soft and it was like six euros. So obsessed. Hashtag obsessed. And as I said, I have a, another sweatshirt, but it's in the washing machine. And I'm sorry. But this is what I bought from H&M online. Obviously, this video is not sponsored because... I have 900 subscribers, which I'm really grateful for, but 900 subscribers are not enough for sponsored videos, trust me, especially especially if you have the number of views that I have. So <laughs> this is obviously not sponsored, but I wanted to share with you my shopping spree and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!